For 17 years now, Dr. Stephen Kleinsmith has been the superintendent of Nixa Public Schools. He saw a lot of potential when coming to Nixa many years ago. I, I saw nothing but potential in so many ways. The curriculum, instruction, assessments, facilities, professional development, uh, on a personal note, opportunities for my family to grow up in a great, safe and progressive community. It was just endless amount of potential. Scott McDonald talks about the process in which the school board is taking to find the next superintendent. As a school board realized that we need some assistance in hiring the next superintendent, someone to kind of help us uh, gather the information, put together the information so we can make the right decision. And, the, and that the board will be the ones making the decision. But So we hired an outside firm to help us with that. We interviewed several different firms and we decided to go with MSBA, MSBA to assist us with it. And so how, have they, how are they helping with uh, that? They're just organizing events. They're, the, all the applications and resumes for superintendents are going to them and they will put those all together and deliver all of them. To the, because as I said, the school board will make the decision. So they'll deliver all those to the school board, but they're just helping to gather that all together so there's one centralized place that they're going to. A year and a half ago, Dr. Kleinsmith announced that he would retire and talks about his plans of retirement. I haven't set my plans in stone yet, but I've sat them in pudding, if you will. A little, little loose still, but getting firmer by the day. Uh, right now I'm planning on working part-time for the university, uh, excuse me, <laughs> Missouri State University. I'm, I'm uh, looking at working like maybe 30 hours a week for Missouri State University mm -hmm. and then I volunteer for the United Way. Uh, and I'm going to be their chairman next year so that comes with some responsibility. The school board is expecting to announce a new leader on December 14th at the public school board meeting. This is Eli Caulfield signing out for Eagle Air TV.